New legal action against the CDC, the Florida group now suing the feds. First, though, a sigh of relief or a tough decision for parents tonight. News 6 takes a closer look at Central Florida's push to get kids 12 and older vaccinated. This is News 6 at 11. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Lisa Bell. It has been nearly a week since the feds approved Pfizer's COVID vaccine for children 12 and older. And tonight, the CDC says more than 600,000 children ages 12 to 15 have been vaccinated since then. But how are things looking in Central Florida? News 6's Nikki Zizaza spoke with public health experts. And Nikki, they say a lot of work needs to be done. That's right, Lisa. Public health experts say there has been some hesitancy among parents to vaccinate young people between 12 and 15 years old. But one Lake County mother we spoke to says it's the desire to return to pre-pandemic life and safety as to why her son rolled up his sleeve. Joyce Patterson and her son Deshaun say they know every shot matters. I want to stay safe. The Lake County mom says once her 14 year old became eligible for a jab in the arm, they were in. He's been homeschooled because I was scared. I haven't even been home to visit my mom. I would think this would be a welcome relief for parents. In this COVID update made public by the American Medical Association, Dr. Paul Offit, who serves as the director of the Vaccine Education Center, says some parents have trouble trusting the science and data despite evidence of the vaccine safety. I think parents should be skeptical of anything they put into either their or their children's bodies. At this point, you have enough information to clearly say that this vaccine is safe and effective. Public health experts say with more people immunized, the virus could have a harder time spreading. If I were to, to convince a parent that the thing that's most compelling to me have been these children with multi-system inflammatory disease. I mean, they have a very similar story. Usually it's six, the six to 14 year old child. Nearly a week after regulators cleared Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine for use and 12 to 15 year olds, the Florida Department of Health reported more than 20,000 Floridians in that age group received a first dose. At last check in Central Florida, Orange County tops the list with 1,885. Brevard County next on the list at 513. Sumter County reporting just a dozen. Meantime, Deshaun says he is looking forward to going back to school and playing sports. Now, while there is some reluctance by parents, health officials say the CDC launched an effort to directly include pediatricians as vaccine providers to ease any reservations. In the newsroom, Nikki Zizaza getting results. News 6, back to you. Nikki, thank you.